Welcome to week number 10. 10. We're hitting double digits. Like I remember I th- when I turned 10. It was like the big 1-0. I think this is officially a thing now. Yeah, I think we can go so far as to call it a thing. Let's get to the questions. All right, if you're not hip to the program, we have Wait, a l- are we actually playing the video? I don't think we're actually playing the video. Um, let's see, let's just go like 27 seconds in. And here we are, we're back in MW2. How exciting. Um, so, if you're not hip to the program, we have 800 questions, and until we answer every single one of them, we're just going to keep doing this and uh, telling some bad jokes and puns. In other words, excuse me, in other news, Edgar still uses the phrase hip to the program. Is it acceptable or unacceptable to smack a child as a form of discipline? Jack, I'll let you have the floor for this one. It is completely unacceptable to think that discipline is something to, you know, look for in your child. The fact that you can say, I will punish you for doing X thing. I'm tired. I can't articulate an argument when I'm tired. Is it acceptable or unacceptable to smack a child? Absolutely not, under any circumstances. Um, and you shouldn't even be aiming to punish. It's, I'm not saying that's a bad form of punishment. I'm saying there's a bad ideology of punishment behind it. I agree. 195. Have you ever been on a space hopper? What the hell is a space hopper? I think this person's like British or something. Um, and I'm thinking that's yeah. like a, I think that's like a moon bounce or bouncy oh. castle. Oh, oh yes, I have. Yes, I have. I think I have once. Question number five forty nine. I know. I know we have answered five thirty nine before, but ah, ah, how, how high can you jump? High enough to tell a bad joke. I think we should have like a song and like a little graphic that displays like Jack's pun or bad joke of the video. Yeah, let's do that. <laughs> So here's my here's my my pun. Uh, I I don't have one. I, I'm just trying to think of one. Bad jokes work too. This is really awkward because I'm sure you actually viewers, listeners don't care about what you're viewing and actually care more about what you're listening to. Um, so I'm sorry, but we cannot move on until I conjure up a pun. Except I have a chopper gunner, so like, it's pr- a pretty big deal. Okay. Um. Let's see. I'm not even trying to come up with them right now. Sorry, I'm just blanking out. It's a really bad chopper gunner. Knock, knock. Who's there? Ocean. Ocean who? You need some lotion, dude. No, and the reason I told that, someone, one of the kids that I work with actually said that to me. Like, he was telling me a knock-knock joke, and then he was like, no, seriously, your hands need lotion. And I looked down, and I was like, oh, yeah, I, I really need lotion. up. Like, these are really dry hands. Okay, moving on. <laughs> I, I don't think I ever used lotion. I hope that's the next question. Do you use lotion? The answer is no. Approximately how many DVDs do you have? How many Blu-rays is the question? Thousands. Approximately 15, maybe 20 DVDs at my house, communally owned by the family. My brother has at least 300. Also, we hardly ever watch them. Next question. 137. Apparently, if it's 153, it's the same. Are you a gambler? No. (laughs) I once... they, They do this thing where they make gambling legal for children by putting it in an arcade and making you buy tokens. But once I literally spent, like, I believe it was at least $60 trying to play one arcade game to win a Nintendo 3DS. Um, yeah. And I, I almost got it many times, but I think the point was that you almost got it many times. The shit is rigged. But yeah, that was actually the only time I've ever... 
Have you ever sucked on a lemon? No. Nope. No, and I, I plan on never... Actually, that sounds like a good idea. Sucking on a lemon. Uh, that's something to try. To say, like, to put in my resume. Jack, do you like your age? Ah, uh, that's a really complicated question. And you have very little time to answer. Oh, yeah. Um, do I like being 17? No, not with what everyone expects of me and having to put up with all this shit. Uh, am I proud of being 17? Yeah. Yeah, I think I am. Bye. And that is the end of the video. Bye. Jack said bye first. Holy shit.